everybody, right now I'm on Linux Mint and I have been trying to update the system but I saw this error message and you guys may have noticed that error message on my computer as well if you guys do notice this error do not start panicking because in this video I will show you guys how to basically fix it in fact it tells us how to fix it <laughs> ok so to fix it all you guys want to do is to sudo tpkg and now I have to do configure configure and then we have to do is do dash a and that should basically start um, fixing every error there is so it's going to fix all the packages that fail to install to do a proper shutdown for example so it's going to be just fixing some stuff it shouldn't take long So this is basically how our guys will be able to fix the error by doing this command and then we should be able to update the system once I fix the error. This may take a while, but we just gotta be patient. Okay, so it does seem like you finished with all of that processing. So basically once you have done that we can do sudo apt upgrade again and that should basically fix the errors that our guys were having. I may have to do sudo apt update as well. Um, the following packages are meant dependencies. Alright, I'm going to do sudo apt update then and see if that fixes the problem. It's like my first time ever seeing this sort of error before. Okay, so, uh, okay. Now everything seems to be up to date now if we do sudo apt upgrade. Just to update off our, um, off our stuff. Okay. So that's a problem, but we can have to fix that. So I might want to run apt fix broken install um, to create these errors. Okay, so I have to do apt um, fix um, broken um, install. Now I'm hoping that will fix the problem that we guys were having. Um, hopefully it does fix my problem but right now what I'm doing is trying to fix all of the broken packages um, because that's a problem I have is with LibreOffice um, because I completely shut down my photo machine just completely while I was updating some packages it does seem like it failed to install LibreOffice due to me exiting from the VM but it could be due to power cuts and etc while I was trying to update the system so I'm trying to fix these broken packages and I'm hoping that it is successful and that's all I really need to do to avoid reinstalling Linux Mint in general because not everyone wants to reinstall Linux Mint they just would still have their data and fix it manually like what I'm doing right now the best part about it is that it tells you what to run like you know apt and less upgradable for example or if I have any broken packages then it will tell you to do apt fix broken install and it would basically just fix all these installs so it's a very nice tool that they have isn't it where they tell you what to run to fix these packages such as um, try apt fix broken install um, with no packages is also a a solution so basically they tell what to run to fix any errors that we're having on the, on the operating system anyway guys hopefully this does fix the problem for me and I'll pause this video right now I guess Okay, um, so now if I try to do sudo apt upgrade again, then hopefully, let me do update as well, sudo apt update and, and um, apt upgrade, this is the moment of truth, um, upgrade, press on to enter, enter a password, now it's going to start hopefully installing some new updates, and yes, it's starting to install some new updates, as you guys can see. So yeah, this basically was a simple tutorial on how to fix a specific error. It should work for um, debian-based distributions like Ubuntu, Linux Mint, and so on. Um, for different distributions such as Arch, it will be different, um, but it should basically be a sort of a um, kind of a similar way anyway of how to fix a sort of error. So this error, of course, when there's a corrupted install that has happened do show an update or when you try to install a, a specific software or or um or a game and if and then we had like a proper shutdown or we'll shut down the photo box machine or we'll just do a proper shutdown on the, um, on the main computer then this error may occur and this means that we'll have corrupted files. So
So what we have done was that we have fixed the corrupt files by reinstalling it and now we'll be able to upgrade it. So we had to firstly fix off the errors and the dependencies. After that we had to basically reinstall the package and now it should be all up to date. So anyway guys, thanks so much for watching this video. I hope that this video has helped you guys with resolving this error. And just remember guys, do not shut down the computer while doing an update because it could have lots of problems such as what I had. Or even worse, we not might be able to boot up at all by seeing the kernel panic. Um, but that's the reason why I would have a backup kernel like I do. I'm probably keeping all the kernel and a newer kernel. But I use a newer kernel, but if I have like improper shutdown while I try and install the new update to the kernel or something like that, then I always have a backup kernel to go to. Anyway guys, thanks so much for watching this video. I will see you guys in the next one. And good luck. Bye-bye.